Here's a hard job I was faced with. Taking these 27 spindles like this, paint them like this. Well, that was only halfway. They want to look like this when they're done. This is a white, kind of an opaque finish. That was a hard job. I tried doing it on my big lathe that I turned them on, but the slowest I could get it to turn was 600 RPM and it slung the paint everywhere. So I got this little 22 RPM motor from the scrap yard, put it on my 17, my $75 lathe from Craigslist. And I come up with this thing that turns 22 RPM, which is just about right. Now I can paint these on here at this speed. Something other like this right here. makes it ever so much easier. When I get down here to the red parts, I don't have to be careful on this lamb's tongue. I just go ahead and paint it and it's kind of scrabbly looking right in here. But then, I can take the sander and sand the flat. You can see how bad that looks. I don't ever do that. <laughs> the lamb's tongue right here and then when I come back with my opaque finish I can be a little bit careful right there that's not too hard to paint around and not get down on the red then it comes out looking like this so I've got uh, different put my paint in different pots different two uh, paint brushes here for me and I'll go through and paint one color then I can come back and paint the next color and cut them all in and it's just about as slick as grease to do this and a whole lot better than trying to sit here and cut it like this or I don't know how other folks do it but Victorian is not exactly easy to come up with something like this but I love my wife and that's what she wants so that's what she gets